What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 20 video. It is 6pm on Tuesday and I believe from now for the next 48 hours, all Prime Icons are in draft at the same time for the first time ever. So if we could uh, eventually load into the game, A, we'll go and test that out. We'll see if there's any new objectives or milestones, which there probably won't be, of course. Uh, we'll see about any new SBCs that EA might have uh, popped in. Uh, so let's start with the uh, season objective. So daily objective and daily objective plus still. Uh, ooh, foot draft player days token. Win four rivals matches. Score a low driven goal in three separate squad battles matches. And assist three goals in squad battles or rivals. And you get a draft token. So that's pretty cool. A draft token for just playing the game. You see on knockout stages... A small Electron Players Pack for the midweek battle. Scoring using UCL players from Bundesliga and Premier League in the same squad battles match or rivals. Uh, score using UCL players in three separate squad battles matches. Um, and assist two goals using UCL players in two squad battles matches and all done in rivals for a premium goal pack, a two red goal players pack and a small Electron Players Pack. Um, and that seems to be it for the season objectives. At least there's something there. There's only like three days left on the season now anyway. And then milestones... It, we uh, yeah why why bother am i right um so as we go into the sbc section uh we have got nothing new there for the time being kolarov San sanchez trezeguet still there kolarov 11 crews so another rare players pack sbc uh this one is gonna cost you seven leagues maximum same league maximum two one club maximum one so they're trying to stop hyperlinks that's interesting Five rare or Champions League players, 80 rated, 85 chemistry. So you could pretty much just do one nation here from all the different leagues and you'd be absolutely fine. Um, no problem at all. And it does seem like that that's it for um, for the SBCs, unless there is something in the players section that we've missed there. Uh, 81 plus and 84 to 91 is still available. No new basic, no new advanced. Um, and then in players, oh yeah, somebody had told me yesterday, you can tell easily if a new player has been put in because it says the reward set. So it's CSL SBC reward, Bundesliga SBC reward two, uh, which means there's nothing new in the CSL, nothing new in the MLS, nothing new in the Liga NOS, um, nothing new in the Saudi League, nothing new in the, the uh, Super League, or the Championship, or the uh, Eredivisie, um, or anywhere else. And then Libertadores and Sudamericana are there which I think are brilliant. I love those a lot. So there's nothing new by way of SBCs except the daily SBC um, and the new objectives. But from what I understand, and we'll te test it with a single player draft first, but from what I understand is that um, the all, all icons should be... Oh, we get a draft token pack as well. Perfect. Yeah, all icons should be available. Now, I'll build um, a, an offline draft to start with. And uh, if it's... If it is a, uh, if it is, if it is the case of it being true, we'll have a draft of glory up ASAP as well. So here we go. Um, all for, all prime icons should be here. Let's see what we start with now. What do we want to take for formation? Let's take some something with a bit of everything. So we don't have center mids in the four four two holding, but it's got a bit of everything else. So what do we have? Well, there you go. Straight away, that is the first time I've seen George Best in uh, the draft this year. That Luis Figo we've had obviously a lot. Stoichkov for the first time ever. Uh, I can't remember if Bobby Moore's been there or not before, but let's take that George Best up front. Obviously, we've had... Uh, it's a shame that the prime moment icons aren't all in draft for the first time ever, um, but prime icons all are. And although EA say for the first time ever, they obviously had that mishap before, and there is a prime moments Ronaldo as well. So prime moments Ronaldo comes in very nice. Yeah, they had that mishap before the other day where we was able to get like 17 or 16 icons um, in every draft. So Victor Wanyama comes on in as well oh there's prime moments petite as well so no they're, they're they're the regular ones in the rotation as is uh haji and Overmars. interestingly enough so we'll take haji so we have got so far five icons out of our first six picks uh we didn't you know it, it's not it's not in a position so there's no left back icon that's interesting we're not in a position where we're being forced to pick icons because it's it's not like five okay this is the first time it's five icon picks, but it's been like mixed in with other other cards and golds and stuff. Uh, so Rio Ferdinand, this is the first time I've seen him in draft. Maldini, this is the first time. Desai, Hierro, and more. Again, he was my captain. Um, but indeed, 
Uh, there's a there's a pick of icons for you there in draft. Now, well, obviously all icons are in draft. I'm just more interested to see which ones pop and uh, how often. So Cannavaro, Beresi, Desai, and Ronald Coleman. So I've used Beresi plenty. Not that I'm actually going to use this team because it is offline and the offline draft is uh, typically shoddy. But interestingly enough, no left back and no right back icon got dropped. And in the current rotation of icons and prime icon moments that are in draft, no goalkeepers are showing up. And it seems to be the case again where no goalkeepers have shown up. Uh, in spite of the fact that there's plenty of prime and prime moment icons. Let's see if we get one off of this pick. Yes, we do. Oh, there we go. Lev Yashin. Remember last year in drafts? He used to pop all the time. And uh, now he's finally popped again. Yashin is there. Can we build a full icon squad? There's our right back. It's Carlos Puyo, not the one that we want. We obviously would have preferred Zanetti. Um, but I think for the next couple of days, guys, we are just going to have nothing but icon drafts. Let's put uh, Big Verge in. At, actually, let's pop him, pop him in at uh, CDM. We can do that for the time being to get that chemistry up. Uh, let's get Velasco there and move on. And it's, it's going to be interesting to play against all the people that also have nothing but icon-only drafts for a couple of days. Next up, we get Prime Moments Rui Costa. We'll take him. We'll pop him in there. Um, and we'll see if we can get a high-rated draft whilst we're here. We, I have, I've missed out on a few big picks that we could have got um, for the sake of the video. There's that 94 Mohamed Salah. He is higher rated than George Best. So we can start him. We've got Prime Moments Ronaldo in there as well. Ooh, Prime Moments Baresi. 94 rated for him too. So we'll actually pop him in there. Um, so Carlos Puyo will come off. And then, again, for rating, we'll lose one by putting Salah in there. Uh, but that is the highest rated squad that we could have in so far. So we've actually picked up 11 icons so far. And it's going to re remain at 11. Let's swap uh, Hazard around for Wanyama. And we'll go and look if there's any packs as well. I didn't see if there was any two-for-one packs. Uh, we'll take that Sarabia, although I don't think he even gets on the bench. Oh, he does. He, he, he just about makes it. There is Mark Overmars. So we'll pop Mark Overmars in instead of Van Dyke right there. Um, and then Van Dyke can go on the bench instead of um, him. So we're up to a 92 rated so far with two picks to go. We can start with a full Icon 11 if we want. Um, I don't know if... Yeah, we'll just put George Best in and then that'll be that. So no more no more Icons there. So those last two picks were bad. So it's only going to be a 192, assuming that we get the, uh, the correct manager. Um, but there you go, 12 Icons in this draft... Uh, he's just 98 chem, 98 chem, 99 for the Portuguese, 98 and 99 for the Italian. So um, it's only a 191, but there you go, guys. Uh, a very, uh, wow, a very wide range. Now, interestingly enough, with regards of icons, I've had about six people in the last few minutes tell me that they've got icons in packs just now. So I wonder if icons are uh, coming up hot as well so there's 550k packs which aren't um which aren't bonuses or or anything like that six percent chance of copy liberator is seven and a half percent chance of an 88 rated player and then prime gold players packs which are a weird price why are they twenty three thousand seven hundred and fifty coins that is not half price I don't know if EA understand. In fact, oh, let me open these now because they're the wrong price. I wonder I wonder if they'll uh, replenish people for, you know, because they made a mistake. Because this, this takes us to, what, 47,500 coins, whereas 45k packs are 45k, not 47,500k. So uh, let me keep some cards here that I know are going to be good. So maybe, just maybe, like this might not be a good idea i might end up just wasting my coins on this account there's only five packs there though so it's only going to cost me 125k or about 120k coins but yeah these are the wrong price we have got a board out of this one as well it's not going to be a walkout um it's going to be a spaniard let's see uh if it's a who, who could it be that i'd be happy with aspas is about the only good one grimaldo lots of players i don't already have uh we'll save those three guys as well and open the next one um but yeah i, I have a just a sneaky suspicion that EA might have to reissue these packs to people um, because they've screwed up on the price, unless the price is this way on purpose. I can't imagine it is. Uh, they're supposed to be half price. Um, oh, and is Martial still worth something? Nope. Wow. Back in the day, he would have been really, really nice, but uh, not anymore for us, unfortunately. Let's pop these players up to the trade pile. I've got 10 spaces left, but we've only got two of these packs to go. Um, 
and uh let's hope that we can hit something big out of one of these so we've got another board that's three boards out of the four packs so far oh that's a man of the match isn't it yeah it is oh, i thought it was going to be copa liberty torres but it's not it's a french man of the match i don't actually know who it is off the top of my head it's oh Colo Colo whatever his name is um we'll keep tadic in there as well um and we'll keep the uh the common cards as well just because they're more valuable than the golds and that will leave us with one more pack a prime gold players pack so tweet me guys tweet me twitter.com slash and penthes tweet me your drafts and how many you get we get another board out of this last pack what are we going to get it's a walkout let's go so we do get a walkout of our Hyung Min Son let's go it's one of the best ones that you can get he's barely worth as much as I paid for all the packs but it is pretty decent I think he's down at about 90k right now um so out of those five packs even if EA don't reissue them I would have made my money back because of Hyung Min Son potentially not profit he's currently 98,000 coins so yeah I with everything else that we got there I absolutely will make my coins back. Um, there's a Maratta in there as well. Um, very nice. Very nice indeed. Let me uh, let me actually list him up straight away to get... I, I want my coins ASAP, basically. I, I, don't, I don't care about Hyung Min Son. I don't need him. I don't want to use him. He won't go into my uh, team in any way, shape or form. And yeah, as I say, I hope that EA will... Um, will allow me though well everyone that's opened those packs back but there you go guys so go and build your drafts let me know what you think in terms in terms of the daily sbc let me actually build that daily sbc uh, it's another 50k pack so we'll be able to get something good out of that as well hopefully hopefully we'll hit something that'll be nice and uh worthwhile for us and maybe yeah put something in a little bit later like they did the other day they haven't so 11 crews um same league max two same club max one leagues max seven um so let's let me go with french for the back line and then we'll we'll have a look at um what we need for the rest of it so we do even though we don't want let's use lecomte he's he's nice and high rated yeah, even though we don't want um duplicates from the same club we do want people from the same nation so uh, let's pop him in there and then let's pop zagadu in there and then if we can get a Bundesliga left back we can I don't really want to use him though or what about a Bundesliga or even just a French right back um I can't use the boys I can use Malquit now we only need this to be 80 rated and I've got oh I've only got one uh bonus rating actually and then we can't use Nzonzi or Bakayoko uh let's have a look at our center mids that are French um we could use Rabio. 83 rated are so cheap right now could use a uh, Mate. He's 78 rated. Can't use Awa. Let's use Rabio. Let's pop him in there. He's good for rating and good for chemistry. Um, so that's two from the Syria. That's two from the French League. So I am going to need a Bundesliga left back here. Um, and then we'll have a look at the nation and go from there. Maybe a German and go for German players outside of that. So we can pop in. Oh, let's, let's use Angelino because he's Spanish. And then we can go for Spanish players outside of that. Uh, obviously, we'll be able to use the Spanish League get our cdms in um so marcus lorente can go in that's one spaniard and then we'll throw in as well and you santi i know he's 82 rated again but i need to boost up that rating just a little bit um so that's four leagues we need a maximum of seven leagues so obviously just the the players from the particular leagues is going to be a bit of a problem so i need non-spanish league striker that's at least decently rated i can't use syria so let's use borja valet um and our chemistry is already good at this stage as well uh so let's uh let me just go and get because we've already got the 85 chemistry now let me just go and get all oh, we can use the dharma triore as well very nice that's banging for chemistry so now i could just go and get any single left wing that fits for rating and el sharawi will do the job so that's our 50k pack guys it is untradeable but it is nice and cheap. Um, so you guys can follow a very sim similar um, kind of trajectory to build your squad. So 150k pack. Hopefully we get that high rated chance uh, out of this one as well. And hopefully we're going to hit something big out of this one as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, no. It's another man of the match. I thought it was going to be a couple of the Dora's card. It's a Dutch man of the match. I, got, oh, I already have him in the club. Um, but it's another man of the match. So uh, it's Tim Krul keeping it cool. The free Radecki. I'll deal with this on my own time, guys. That is going to be the end of the video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.